non-league matchup. Lafayette from the Patriot League taking on the Jaspers of Manhattan, hailing from the Mid-Atlantic Athletic Conference. They're coming out of a 2-2-2. It looked like they bounced into a 1-4-1 out of it when they hit the other wing, but looks like they're staying in the 2-2-2 offensive set. Breaking through and taking a shot and a goal there. Harsh angle. Taylor Skaggs finds the mark. Start and stop and back up again. That's Jake Mann, one of the captains. He's a senior midfielder wearing number 33. There's yep. an angle shot, and that one will go. Lafayette tying it up. I believe that was Mac Gallagher. And the Leopards getting stretched. His Manhattan goes almost all the way to mid field before they start up again there's a shot and a goal five hole on jake oh my they're coming out of a two three one set just the wing guy pinching in a little bit and just just That's squeezed one by play is yet to be discontinued floyd remains out there for the moment and there's a shot and the goal and there's the advantage play at its best and that that was just Painful to watch because they worked for, as I said, I don't want to beat a dead horse. They worked for such great shots. Nice head fake. Oh, nice yes. Goal. Left hand shot there by Rob Orzetti. Sets him up with the pump fake, like a head shoulder fake. Little jog. Got the defenseman to step left. And then he basically stepped right around him and pulled the trigger. See Lafayette extending way out right now. And they're collapsing back in. Oh, my. Solo effort is good. They're bouncing it right at the ankles of Jake Hyatt with some success. And there is a second goal for Tyler Idell, the junior attackman. Um, you know, you can you can throw them near the goal all day. If they're not on the cage, they don't have a chance of going in. So we've bounced a handful over. Oh, There's yeah. a laser. Beautiful shot. Number 33 for Lafayette. That's Jake Mann taking matters into his own stick. Well, that was a pretty quick move there. He's got to be careful on that one. And there's a free man. It worked out pretty well for Manhattan that time. They kept working it until somebody erupted unmolested. And uh, coming on strong for that goal, I believe, was number 20. No harm there. Sunny Round able to go back and get it. Here's... Ah. Five nice seconds. inside oh, roll. Oh, what a play. There's a season highlight. Beautiful shot there on the ground. Number five, he is uh, in danger of scoring a hat trick. He's got his two goals already. Look out. There's an easy one. Number 28, Ryan Payton. He is the uh, leading scorer on this squad. And that makes his second of the night. Back-to-back -back goals for Ryan Payton kind of sucking everybody down if they're passing the ball behind, but towing goal line extended. It'll allow the defenders to sag that. There, yep, we, there go. we go. Top Six shot. on four. Lafayette gets it done with a shot from Brian Bach. So it'll be a 30-second shot clock. Pass out front. This is dangerous, and there's a goal. Just a ripping shot. Um, he's been a mainstay for the Leopards for the last few years. Great player. Turn Here's the corner. A nice shot. Beautiful play. Solo effort by Mac Gallagher, sophomore midfielder out of Ardmore. Did a fantastic job getting hip to hip and then blown on by. Or is that he's done a great job creating tonight? I'd give him the ball, Gio. Is that Yes! Five hole for him. And Lafayette has its two goals in a row at 8.23 to play. Orzetti with his third goal of the night. Seven all. That is an eternity. He's extending Long the pass. field. Boom. You're going to probably see them banging. Uh oh. Deflected. Nice pickoff. Beautiful deflection. Hyatt with the 15 ball. 15 seconds. Matt Evans with a defensive play. 10, 10 seconds. seconds. Leopards getting Five. the numbers they need. Now Two. the run. Pass is lost. Bounces around. We're going into overtime, ladies wow. and gentlemen. 7-7 seven, seven at the end of regulation. And here come the Jaspers of Manhattan. Brett Matteris working on the Lafayette defense. Yeah, you can't sag off of those outside shooters in a situation like this. Uh-oh. Oh, and there it is. There's a goal. Just worked one-on-one. -on -one. 
waited wow. for the Lafayette player, engaged him, got the overhand shot in, boom, done. Tyler Idell for the third time. And he gets that game-winning goal with 3.16 left in double overtime. 